Right, uh, I was going through my wardrobe, sorting bits and pieces out, doing the old, you know, spring clean, just a, a whole season a bit behind, but hey, we're not really counting this year, right? This year doesn't doesn't count for anything. Just doing a little spring clean in my wardrobe, and I discovered a load of shoes that, that I, I mean, when I look at it now, I think I can't believe that, that I bought them, to be honest. It's not really me, it's not my taste. But many years ago, I went through a phase of going shopping with my friends and being massively peer pressured by my friends to get the cool new shoes. Um, and a lot of times I, I fell for this trap and I did buy said shoes to wear them probably once and then not wear them again. Already the first life lesson of this video is um, don't ever buy stuff to fit in with a crowd. You don't have to follow the trends to be cool because it, later on in life that matters l less and less. I can imagine if you're young and watching this then you'll disagree with me and think you know you need the newest phone or the newest this that and the other or the, to, to be cool. Um, which when you're younger I guess is a thing. But when you get when you get older it's, it's definitely not a thing. Some of the shoes are all right. Some of the shoes are okay. Everyone's got their own tastes and things, um, but these shoes, looking back on it, are definitely not my type of shoe. I thought I would get my girlfriend, Diane, to come up here, and I'm gonna get her to rank them in order of rankness. Right, now a lot of these shoes, I'm digging them all out now, and a lot of them, you ready for this? Keep your eyes closed, don't peek. And open. You're actually wiping out off all the dust. <laughs> okay. Oh. <laughs> what the hell? They were doing well until you found the padlocks on the back. The padlocks come off. I just lost the key for them. But the, shut up. But they, yeah. did, they did not come with a key. Of course, they came with a key, so you can lock. Shut up. Did yeah. they actually come with a key? No, they did. They did. These Basimis. Basi or, or Bashemi? I think they're called Bashemi. I may be and wrong. How much did you pay for this? I I can't remember, but did you? Were you one of those people that spent so much on your shoes? But no, this is what I was explaining before. Uh, I think Ollie. I think Ollie did inspire me to get a pair of these. To be fair, I think that that these, are, these were these actually are the best of a bad bunch. The, yeah. Keep your eyes closed. Hold your hands out. Like flat, so you can hold shoes. Ready? Open. <laughs> oh no! You, please tell me you never wore them. <laughs> what the hell? Is, it's not a lion, it's not a person, it's not an angel. No, it's Versace. Like, but knowing me, can you imagine me wearing these? I could never in a million years <laughs> imagine you putting on this gold plate of Versace shoes. <laughs> what friend of yours made you get these? Because I would never want you to be their friend again. I can't remember who I was with. I think it was Casper. Where are you going to put them? Oh, which is the worst? So, best to worst. Okay, they're on that side for now. Okay, so they're worse, worse than these ones. Okay, we're yep. getting we're getting a ranking system on the go. Okay, next pair. Now, I actually quite li like these. I've just never worn them. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Open your eyes. Okay. These are alright. These are Yeezys, so they're more like trainers. Yeah, I like Yeezys. I actually do like Yeezys. I can't remember for the life of me where I got these from, who, where where I bought oh, like, these from. Oh, Yeezys Adidas. I like yeah. them, Joe. Yeah. You should wear these ones, actually. Do you do like those? Yeah, no, I'm, I'm alright with them. Okay. I'm okay with that. Alright. Do you fart? No. Oh, <laughs> these are my faves so far. Okay, so they go there. Ooh, alright. Okay, next pair. Right, hold your hands up. Let me just show, let me just show before you look at them, just show the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Open. Oh, these are a Gucci pair, aren't they? Oh, you know the brand. I do because you know what? I actually got I got peer pressured into buying a pair of. Them. Hey, the Gucci peer pressure. I've got, I've got it's a, a thing. Pair of Gucci's as well, which uh, to be fair, I did like them at the time. I don't. I don't actually like. You'd think a pair of Gucci shoes you wear them all the time, but I actually they're, they're my only pair of like. What do you call them? Brand name shoe, and I never wear them. So look, these aren't too bad. Face. Everyone, everyone had a pair, right? Yep. But they, no one had the high tops. Right. So I was in there, and I, obviously, as you can see from this, I do like a high top. Love so I looked top. at them, and I was like, if I was ever going to get a pair of Gucci shoes, would I would get top. those ones. Look. And at the time, I said, look, I don't need them. I don't need them. I don't need these shoes. I've got plenty of other rank pairs of shoes. Yes. <laughs> and th and they they peer pressured me into doing it. So I had these. I've worn them, I think, twice in my life. Really? You've really worn them a long time. Yeah, they? they look quite scuffed, don't they? They look very scuffed. I don't know. I could probably see you still wearing these. Do you think? It. So where are you going to rank these on the scale? Good to bad. I think I'm going to pop them in here. 
Oh, worse than the, worse than these yeah. ones. Okay, the next pair. Hold your hand out. <laughs> you need very, before you open your eyes, just feel them. Oh, I just did. What the actual hell? You cannot tell me you've got a pair of Velour shoes. Like juicy, Velour? Like juicy couture. What does that mean? Velour is like velvet. Sounds like it was casting a spell. Right, open. Oh, no, I'm scared. No. <laughs> What the hell, Joe? As if you've never worn these, have you? I've I've worn them once, I think. I think I've worn them once or twice. And yeah, because the bit there's a bit sure of like people were just looking at you, going like, "Who dressed you?" Yeah. Wow. Casper got given a present of some navy blue ones. Right. And they, I was like, "Wow, they're so cool." And they were really, really cool, it was right? Navy blue, probably. Yeah. Um, and uh, I loved them. I thought they were really cool. But the only thing is, Casper, they, they take so long to lace up. To get your foot in and lace it all up is an absolute choice. Uh, but then I saw these red ones. I can't remember actually where I got them from. But mm. if you're going to rate them, uh, yeah. as my girlfriend, they rating look my uh, they look so small. my old um, shoe choices, where are you going to put them on the scale? I'm going to have to put Good to worst. In here. <gasps> really? Wow. These are velvet shoes. What's wrong with a velvet shoe? They're velvet, Joe. Now, what do you think of these? Heavy. Open. Oh. <laughs> oh wow. These. They, oh no. Do you not like? But no one like unless you're. I always think. If you're over five years old, never have a Velcro. Ooh, controversial. Never have a Velcro. Well, that's rich coming from you because you can't even tie your own shoelaces. I know, but I would still never get Velcro, Joe. Now, I do like my high tops, right? So I do. Yeah. I did actually quite like them at the time. Yeah. But bear in mind, look how big they are. And, they are and when I put them on, you see the size of my legs, look. Yeah, like you, they are heavy as well. Yeah, so when I put them on, I look ridiculous. They're quite subtle, they're just big and subtle. Yeah, they're actually, they're actually all right. The only thing I don't really like is the Velcro. Velcro. I think I'm gonna pop them in here. Really? Yeah. Interesting. And I don't really like an all black shoe either. Like all black is a bit much. I love how you're saying that, but look. The top three are all all black. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> What's wrong with them? They're almost all black. I might these. I'm these are growing on me. I'm thinking I might be replacing them. Um, yeah. Really? I'm thinking that I might have to do that one. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Right. That's what I'm going for. There's two pairs left. I feel like it's Christmas. Right, hold your hands up. Open your eyes. <laughs> no. Oh my god, you liked them so much, you got them in two colours! <laughs> how could you? I'm so disappointed in you! And I'm sure someone out there would think these are the most beautiful shoe. Maybe, maybe. You know, let's think. I just want to point out, these is all to everyone's uh, individual taste. So for some people, they might really like this brand. Exactly. But for me, I, I, I just know, post all this, I know that it's not my... I think a lot of you guys will know as well. It's not that's not my style and not my taste. Nothing against the brands at all. I think you know there's there's a mark out there for everyone. But for me, it's more of a kind of like, Joe, you know this is not your style. What were you thinking? Story behind these. I actually bought those the same time as I bought these. So I bought them both together. together. Because you couldn't decide. Whether couldn't decide on the white or the black. So I, so I, Casper in my ear, be like, you could both, buddy. And and how much were they? I'm not. I don't want to talk about it. Oh, we've got a new no. Yeah. Pull Versace down here at the bottom. Oh. Give, before you open your eyes, give him a little feel. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> open your eyes. Oh, Joseph. <laughs> These aren't a pair that you wore on Strictly, are they? No, they're not. I bought those with intention to wear them out and about, thinking that they were, you know. Because they're quite sparkly though, aren't they? Joseph. They are a bit strictly. They but... are so You had a pair like this for your first number. I... Did you ever wear them? I, yeah, I've got many, many occasions. Where did you wear these? This is the big they're choice. Definitely, they're definitely in this... In the bottom half. In the bottom right. So I think it's safe to say that the Yeezys have actually won. Yeezys have definitely won. I'm gonna go... I think this is what we're locking in. Best to worst. Uh, in first place, we have the Yeezys, followed by the dusty old uh, Buscemi. Sorry if I'm saying that wrong, I have no idea. Then these um, Gucci ones, 
then these Yeezys, yeah, then nice. these old school Gucci's with the rhinestones, like, like, no, it, then the Tom Fords, a bit like, um, the velvet Tom Fords, and then unfortunately in last place we got these absolute Humdinger. <laughs> I think we should get some other YouTubers to give us a go. JJ KSI has an incredible shoe collection, um, so I think Simon should go through and rank his shoes from best to worst as a friend, being brutally honest. Um, but there you go, that is the end of the vlog. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Uh, subscribe to Diane, I'll put a link down below. Um, hit the little bell, do a little dance, get down tonight. <laughs> get down tonight. Do a little dance. See ya.